the eve of a major municipal election that will decide the leadership here in New Orleans, voter turnout will be a big, if not the biggest, factor in tomorrow's election. And as Tan Chung reports, some communities that have been politically quiet are trying to make their voices heard. Campaign signs are lining the streets in New Orleans East, home to a unique Vietnamese American population. But when it comes to election year issues, it's like any other neighborhood. For us, the issues are very similar to everybody else's issues. I mean, we still have a lack of jobs, uh, opportunities out here, uh, lack of uh, economic development. Historically, voter turnout from the Vietnamese community here in New Orleans East has been relatively low. But since Hurricane Katrina, there's been a bigger push to get more politically involved. For the past eight years, we've been registering folks to vote. We've been educating them on how to vote. Min Nguyen says his organization promoted early voting for this election, which so far has seen 10,218 people cast early votes. Compare that to the more than 17,000 early voters in the previous city election. That 2010 mayoral race saw an overall voter turnout of 32 percent. The registrar of voters says turnout for Saturday's election could be strong, and better weather should help. Well, I'm thinking that it's going to be nice weather. People can plan all their activities, but one activity they really need to plan is to go out and vote if they haven't voted early already. Political analyst Clancy Dubo says turnout will be a critical factor for two candidates in the mayor's race. Well, the bigger the African American turnout, the better it is for Mike Bagnaris. But the flip side of that is. Mitch Landrieu has a very significant level of support among African Americans as well. So it's not just a question of how many, it's really a question of who. A question voters answer tomorrow. Tom Trump, Eyewitness News. And tomorrow, voters will determine the quality of life in the city of New Orleans for the next four years with a number of important races on the ballot. One of the biggest, of course, being the mayoral election, where voters will choose between incumbent mayor Mitch Landrieu. Former civil court judge Michael Bagnaris and local NAACP president Donatus King. Other big races include those for sheriff, coroner, both council at large seats, council districts A, C, D, and E seats, and the clerk of criminal court.